In Daytona Beach, a four-year-old is in a hospital after police say a man dangled the boy over a balcony and then dropped him headfirst. Flesh 2's Pamela Combe talked with a woman who saw it all unfold. What should have been a relaxing Saturday at the Sandals Inn Resort in Daytona Beach ended in a horrifying scene. He was just like swinging him, playing with him, and then he let him go and he had him by one foot. And then the kid slipped right out of his head and fell directly on his head on the concrete. No grass. Dasani Bentley says she watched as a four-year-old boy being dangled from a balcony fell. Police say the suspect, 31-year-old Brandon Gilmore, had just met the boy's mother a few hours before. Gilmore allegedly told the mom he was going to go outside to play with the four-year-old and, quote, scare him a little bit. That's when he took him outside and allegedly held him from both legs and dangled him over the second floor balcony. Bentley says the child took a pretty bad hit. His face started turning bright purple. He obviously was getting no oxygen. It was just not a good situation. That's when Bentley says Gilmore and the child's mom ran downstairs. They were just all down, like all around him, trying to make sure he was okay. People were screaming from the pool, like to not touch him. Witnesses say the mom picked the child off the floor and took him back to the room. Police eventually arrived and arrested Gilmore. The four-year-old was taken to the hospital as a trauma with possibly severe internal injuries. Absolutely devastating. I don't even know how I'd react if that was my own. Reporting in Daytona Beach, Pamela Combe, West 2 News. It's an awful case. We did reach out to get an update on the child's condition. As for Gilmore, he's being held at the Volusia County Jail on an aggravated child abuse charge with no bond.